Hey folks, welcome to another how to Casio video. In this video, we're going to be looking at how to find the mean, median, quartiles for this particular data on this particular FX8200 AU calculator. So without further ado, let's get started. All right, folks, so with this calculator, what we want to be doing is uh, switch on the calculator first. That would be a good start. Uh, we're going to go down to statistics mode right here on the main menu. Click on statistics and right now we've got one variable. So we're going to click on one variable. Now sometimes what it does is it does pop up with um, would you like to delete the previous data. Let me show you what I mean by it. Like, like let's say if there was some other numbers that were actually here. Then what's going to happen is if we go back, go into stat mode, one variable. Well, it doesn't do that but here we go. What we can do is just click on this delete button and it should pretty much delete all of your previous data. So what we're going to do is we're going to put in all of these numbers in this particular table. So right now we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine numbers, which means we should, when we finish this, this number here should be at nine to show that we've actually entered nine numbers. So we're going to enter 17, 20, 24, 20, 19, 18, 22, 23, and finally 20. Now, at this point, we've actually entered all the numbers. And what we're going to do is we are simply going to just press EXE. And that will take you to this menu where it'll ask for one variable results. And we can just click on that straight away. And as you can see, there is a whole lot of things that are happening here. Now, you might need to kind of uh, uh, look at it a little bit closer. But what I will do is I'll write down what the codes are. So the first one is the X bar, which with a little bar on top. Now that is the mean, which in this case is 20.33. Then looking at it, we've got a few other things. We've got standard deviation there, but we're gonna go and have a look at this N. N is nine. That's telling me that nine bits of data was entered here. We've got min X, which is 17. That is our minimum value. Then after min X, we've got Q1, which is 18.5. Now Q1 is the lower quartile. So Q1 is 18.5. The median is MED. So that is what the median is. And the median is 20. And now upper quartile is Q3. So Q3 is the upper quartile, which is 22.5. We also have the max there, which is equal to 24. Now, unfortunately, it looks like this particular calculator doesn't have the mode in it. But well, let's actually figure out what the mode manually is. I mean, I guess we can kind of have a look at here and we can see that 20 appears three times. So the mode is actually 20. But other than that, folks, um, that is pretty much how you calculate um, some of the sample statistics for this particular data on this particular calculator. Mm -hmm. 